There is an age old saying In the midst of the chaos have peace of mind like a monk and the rest will be bearable Monks saints and buddhas are considered some of the world's most spiritually enlightened people They impart wisdom through their words and uplift our thoughts through their actions Let's imbibe some pearls of wisdom from a monk who teaches us one such important life lesson about peace of mind Years ago monks would go out every day with a bowl to collect morsels of food Wherever they went they were greeted with great hospitality The villagers had a spiritual tradition where offering food to a holy monk or saint was considered a noble deed On a fine day one such monk was traveling through an unknown village He visited many houses and wherever the monk would go and knock the lady of the house would come out with some cooked food and offer it to him Regardless of what the food is with deep devotion the monk would accept the food bless the lady thank her and go on his way Soon he reached a house with the most beautiful flowers in the garden The monk smiled looking at the flowers The lady of the house was watching him through her window enraged by his presence she opens the door and yells at him What are you doing here I am just admiring the beautiful flowers in your garden he replied I know exactly why you are here She yelled back The monk chose not to respond to her You are here to beg for food are you not The monk calmly nodded his head Why are you standing there begging for food You look fit enough to me Why do you not work for a living She screamed The monk calmly stood there denying her any response She noticed that the monk had not reacted at all This made her even more angry and she screamed Why don't you say anything you lazy monk Why are you standing like a stone At last the monk broke his silence Mother he said with great humility You have made me an offering but if I choose not to accept it then to whom does this offering belong An offering shouted the lady I have offered you nothing you lazy fool but mother ever since i have come to your doorway you have been offering me whatever you have to give he answered the lady was intelligent she realized that the monk was talking about her abuses because that was all she had to offer he also meant that by refusing to accept her offering it now belongs to no one but herself its rightful owner this experience of the monk teaches us that the world is filled with negative people but we can choose to stay calm and shield ourselves from receiving their energy it's important to remember that no matter how strongly the other person expresses their negativity unless and until we accept it it simply cannot touch us